All right, guys, so it's the same evening as the last video. I went back to the truck and took a little bit of a break, and I decided to come back and do a little fly fishing this afternoon. Something I've been wanting to play with for a while, ever since I bought this reel. So this is a Martin Mohawk. This is a antique fly fishing reel. And what's cool about it, I think, is the fact that it's an automatic. So it has this little lever right here. There's no handle. There's no crank on it. You just lift this little lever, and it automatically winds in the in the line. I found it at an antique shop in Oklahoma City. And this thing is old. It's from the 50s. And I've been wanting to fish with it ever since I got it. And uh, just hadn't took the time to get it out. But I think it'd be a good evening to get out here and play with it a little bit. I've got it on a Ozark Stream Supreme fly rod. So I'm going to get out here, pitch around, and see if I can catch a few bluegills on this thing. And right there. Here we go. Look right there. I did it. I did it. Green sunfish right there. On the Martin. Cool deal. Uh-oh. All right, guys. Well, mission accomplished, I guess. I didn't think it would take too long. There we go. Here's another one. What do we have this time? Another green sunfish. All right. I waited till it got even. I knew. Oh, easy now. I knew as I got later into the evening these green sunfish would move up into these rocks. So I should be able to pitch it along here. Yep, there we go. We'll catch a few. There he is. There we go. Hey. All right, man. Cool. Hey, I'm having fun. Look. Cool deal. Here we go. Oh, that one got away. Don't have a ton of time left, but I should have enough time to catch a handful of these guys. Oh, there was a bite. Oh, missed him. Got my bait. All right, guys, let me get another piece of bait on. I'll be right back. Here we go. Here we go, guys. Hey. Pretty good fish right here. Hey, pretty good fish right here, look. Hey, easy. Look at this one, guys. That's not a bad one right there. Let me get the pliers on this one. Come on. Okay. 
yeah, this guy got it pretty deep. I bet I can get him off there. Oh, yeah. There we go. Oh. Well, say that. There we go. We got him. We got him. Here you go, guys. Green sunfish right there. All right. Whoa, fall down and hurt myself on these rocks. Let's get that back out there. Let's do that again. Oh, oh, there he is. <laughs> Look at that one. He was right there. He was right there. There he is. There he is. Got him. Got him. Another one. Another one. Easy. Another one, guys. Look. Man. This is cool. Let me turn you guys around just a little bit. Get you guys right there. Uh-oh, got the line wrapped around the end of the rod there. That ain't good. Oh, I got a fish too. Oh, he got off. Nope, I got him. I got him. I got him. <laughs> I had him. I had him the whole time. I thought he got away. Probably got away, look. Look at that. Man, these guys are up here now. There he is. There he is. Look at that one. Got him. Got him. Pretty little fish right there. Right, let's do it again. There he was, I missed him. Got him. <laughs> Got him. Yep. Gotta be careful with these guys. Yeah, they got big mouths. I can definitely swallow it. Okay. All right. I think I got enough bait on there to do it again.
Yes. <laughs> Look at this one. Look at that little bitty one. It's a little small one out there. There he is. Well, these guys are up there now. There you go. Try that. Here he is. Oh, he came off. Dang it. There he is one. Missed that one. Let's give that back to him. Come on. Miss that one too. Pitch it out there a little further. I could run into a little bit bigger one. Hey, here comes a here comes a turtle after my bobber. Get out of here. Got him. Got him. Got him. All right. Oh, man. Get the pars on this one, too. Well, there we go. Got him. All right, guys. I need to get another piece of bait, and I'll be right back. 